today is another Ipsy unboxing. If you want to know what I got for the Ipsy glam bag this month, so this is the September month, then keep on watching. Like my background I did this more for my daughter so when we do lifestyle and like food and other non makeup videos then we might set up here once in a while so I got the ipsy glam bag I think it's like $12 a month subscription and you get one or two full-size products and four other deluxe size products I was actually planning to skip this month but I forgot to cancel my subscription so you'll see Ipsy every now and then every other month because I don't really care for um, deluxe samples like I don't know it's not as exciting to me but I do get excited for the Ipsy bags that's what I look forward to more than the makeup that goes in here but when they do have full-size products they are pretty pretty good if you haven't seen my last month's Ipsy bag it was my very first live guys and I was so nervous at the time and everything was new to me but it was a fun live. I had my girls, my supporters, my subscribers with me, and I'm so thankful that they were there for me to help me calm down. But that was my very first live, very first Ipsy unboxing as well. So definitely check that out. I like the products that I got last month. So this month is kind of more fall themed, and I did see the items inside. So let's go ahead and get started. So right away, I saw this kind of sweater looking Colderoy, is that Colderoy? Is that the term for these? Like this Colderoy material, you know, reminds you of fall and cold weather. I'm ready for it. Like I'm a fall person. I just realized that I hate summer. It's too hot, I sweat ugly, and it's just not fun for me. Although I love like summer dresses and all of that stuff, but um, it's a lot. It's a lot to maintain. Oily face, oily skin, no makeup makeup looks. It's a lot of maintenance for me personally when it comes to the summertime. But fall, like the weather is cooling, it's not too cold, sweater weather. And so this definitely reminds me of that season. It has a nice ipsy detail like this. Without giving you guys a sneak peek, you have like the Ipsy logo inside. So I love their bags. Like I don't mind paying $10 for like these little makeup bags. Although, you know, they do add up. That's why I love like the every other month. And what I love about Ipsy is that you can pause subscription. So you can pause it for one month. You can pause it for two months. Restart it up whenever you want. I wish BoxyCharm had that feature. Um, but instead you have to like pretty much cancel the whole subscription if you wanted to stop BoxyCharm. Not that I don't like BoxyCharm, but I'm going to be pausing BoxyCharm on the months that I have FabFitFun boxes. As much as I love getting boxes, the products do pile up and I really want a chance to appreciate the products that I get and really get a lot of use out of it and actually go back to the basics where I review products rather than unbox them. Looking forward to that, so slowing down my subscriptions and um, playing with makeup. Okay, so here's what I got. Outside of this bag is actually you have the card. It says good vibes. I think that's the theme for September 2020. This month, radiate positivity from trying a bold new hairstyle to finding the perfect fall lip color. When you embrace this season of change with an I got this attitude, the result will be out of sight. Definitely positive vibes only. You know who I remember saying those words? is a good friend of mine on YouTube, Blanca Miss is Queen B. She has a YouTube channel and she loves to say that at her intro, outro. Ipsy doesn't have a card with all of the products that are in your bag. So it looks like it has some tips like sunscreen plus antioxidant together is good for the AM routine. Cream plus powder blush, you know, gives you that glowy cheek. So there's some tips there that's worth reading. The first thing that was outside of the little bag was this cute highlighter brush. And it's a highlighter brush by Bo Capiz. I'll have the exact name in the description below. It's like a flat 
flat brush. Last month, I did get the Lovecraft Beauty Highlighter. I love the color of this, guys. Let's try this brush. I hope I don't break out because I didn't wash it yet. It's a little stiff. I don't know about it being a highlighter brush. I like my highlighter brushes to be a little more flowy, but you know what? I also feel like this would be a good brush for the crease. Like if you wanna buff out the crease, I think this is nice for the crease because it's nice and flat and pinched and also stiff. Okay, so now we go into our bag. So the next item here is the Jaunt Blue Ultra Lash Formula. I believe this is a art makeup professional liquid eyeliner and it's a 24 hour liquid eyeliner. Ooh, it's a pretty thick one though. So we're not gonna wing it out or anything. There, just to kind of line the lashes. I don't do wing liners a lot. I don't use a lot of liquid liners, so I do need a lot of practice. If anything, I use it to hide the band on my lashes so that it blends nicely. Not bad. It's a pretty stiff felt tip, but I feel like it's not very thin. It will generate kind of a thicker wing. So if that's your style, I think that's going to be good for you. Let's give it a minute and see how this is going to look. It does look pretty shiny, so it doesn't look matte, but maybe it's just drying down. So I love that I got that and that's full size. So I've got two full size products, guys, for $12 pretty much. The third item that I got is a free matic highlighter by Douche, Douche, Douche. Tell me how you pronounce this brand. I'm not going to open this because remember, I already kept the highlighter from my last Ipsy bag. So this one is going to go in a giveaway. I don't want to take out the plastic or anything. I wish I could show you the color. If I can find it, I'll put it up here on the screen so you guys can check it out. Let's look at this, the Pore Professional Hydrating Primer. So you get to choose one item from the Ipsy Glam Bag that you can have. And so when I picked this, I was expecting to get, I mean, this is as big as my thumb. I was expecting to get like the deluxe travel size one. And you know the ones that are by the Ulta register when you're in line. So I was expecting it to be like a tad bit bigger, way more product than this. And I picked this for my subscriber giveaway because I was thinking, you know what? I can give this, everybody will love it. Anybody who has dry skin will love this poor professional. I don't, I, I can't. This is too tiny for the giveaway. But definitely, I can add this like as a bonus sample size for sure. And the last items, it's by Pacifica Matte Blush and Bronzer Duo. So this is what it looks like. 100% vegan and cruelty free. I am starting to really gravitate towards makeup and skincare that is more vegan and cruelty free. You know, like good for you stuff and i really want to try this here it is <gasps> look at that oh my gosh so pretty this is so pretty this bronzer shade isn't gonna be my bronzer shade or is it comment down below if i should keep this blush i want it because it's a cruelty makeup and i really want to transition to those and pacifica is not a very expensive brand which i like so i love having that option okay let me just quickly kind of show you kind of sneak peek but it has a mirror guys the mirror is so big how's your makeup how's it holding up <laughs> Oh, I want to keep it. I'm glad that I had my subscription for this month. This is even better than last month, I have to say. Just to recap, we got five items. The first one is the nice double-sided kind of little baggie from Ipsy. We got the highlighter brush, the wing liner or liquid liner. We have the little itty bitty professional a little deluxe size highlighter like i wouldn't mind highlighters to be this small because i know you just use a little bit on your face but like poor filling primers i mean we need a lot especially if you have my kind of pores 
<laughs> you're gonna need a whole lot of product and then the last item is the pacifica blush and bronzer duo with an amazing mirror by the way before i give a product away or let it go i need to know more about the brand especially if i'm curious about the brand especially if i like what the brand stands for cruelty free vegan i feel like i need to try it firsthand before you know letting others try it so i think i might keep this what do you guys think about my ipsy bag do you like it do you not like it you think it's worth 12 dollars a month i definitely do this month this is way better than my last month's ipsy bag i feel like um three full-size products you can't beat that i love that i get brushes from ipsy because then i don't have to buy my own brushes right um and I've been wanting to get brushes. Like, where are the Luxie brushes from BoxyCharm? Where are they? I mean, that's one of the reasons why I signed up for BoxyCharm was to get some brushes. I and mean, they've been skincare heavy lately. Although those are amazing because skincare is pretty expensive. It's not pretty. It's really expensive. Um, so I don't mind it either. So everybody has their ways. But I was kind of hoping it's time. It's time for some tools, some makeup and skincare tools. I think from boxycharm anyway i digress ipsy is definitely filling in the gaps and that's what i love like having different subscription boxes i get the lifestyle side from my fab fit fun and i get my makeup from ipsy and boxycharm so it's all good everybody's happy so yes so this was a fun unboxing i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i post videos once a week on skincare and beauty reviews as well as some unboxings here and there there's gonna be new boxes in my channel as i pause other boxes along the way so definitely be on the lookout for that and with that said i hope you guys have a beautiful sunday sunday is today that i'm filming have a great rest of your day and i'll definitely see you back in my corner soon bye Bye.